Welcome to this demonstration on how to properly apply a pelvic binder. In this video, we'll go through the steps for applying a pelvic binder to stabilize pelvic fractures and reduce bleeding. Let's get started. A pelvic binder is indicated in cases of suspected pelvic fractures, typically resulting from high energy blunt force trauma such as MBAs, falls, or crush injuries. Pelvic binders are used to provide rapid circumferential compression and stabilization of the pelvic ring, which can help reduce bleeding, minimize pain, and decrease the risk of further injury. To start, you'll need a pelvic binder, which is a wide elastic band that wraps around the pelvis. HCEC ambulances carry at least two pelvic binders, one in the cabinet behind the captain's chair and the other in the outside driver's side compartment. First, position the patient on their back with their legs straight and together. If the patient is wearing clothing, cut or remove any clothing that may interfere with the placement of the pelvic binder. The pelvic binder should be slid underneath the patient's posterior hips and positioned at the level of the greater trochanters. The binder should be centered on the front of the pelvis with the ends of the binder extending toward the back. Ensure that the binder is not too tight or too loose as it needs to provide enough pressure to stabilize the pelvis without causing discomfort or restricting breathing. Secure the binder in place by fastening the Velcro straps or clips. The binder should be snug but not too tight allowing for expansion of the abdomen during breathing. Once the pelvic binder is in place, ensure that the patient's pelvis is stabilized and that there is no visible bleeding. Check the patient's pulse, respiratory rate, and blood pressure to monitor for any changes. Although the pelvic binder procedure can be performed by one provider, it is recommended to have two. When applying a pelvic binder, it's essential to ensure that the binder is properly positioned and secured. Check for any discomfort or restriction of breathing and adjust the tension accordingly. Thank you for watching this demonstration on how to properly apply a pelvic binder. Remember, timely and effective application of a pelvic binder can make a significant difference in the outcome of a patient with a pelvic fracture. Thanks and stay safe.